Welcome to the Duke Pellet Garage. My name is Brian, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to get a tough, durable epoxy finish in just one step. VHT roll bar and chassis paint is a tough, durable epoxy finish that is corrosion, rust, and salt resistant, and also heat resistant up to 250 degrees, and that makes it a perfect product for the frame, core support, and other odds and ends here in the engine bay of this El Camino. So what Mark and I are doing is we're finished stripping things down and getting it prepped for paint. All right, I'm to the point where I have everything out of the way that I'm that needs to be out of the way. Uh, we fresh washed it, we wire brushed all the loose rust out of the way. Next up now is spraying down some of the Ducapeller prep spray. This is our solvent prep spray. It's good for initial uh, paintwork like we're doing here. This is going to remove any oils and greases that the pressure washer didn't get. It'll give us a good clean surface for the VHC roll bar and chassis to bond to. Once I'm good and clean here. We'll finish masking off anything that needs to be masked. We'll lay down the paint. VHT Roll Bar and Chassis Paint is a unique one-step protective epoxy coating that dries in minutes and does not require the use of a primer. VHT Roll Bar and Chassis Paint gives the appearance of a tough, baked-on finish that is chemical, corrosion, rust, and salt resistant. Ideal for use on roll bars, grill guards, nerf bars, tools and equipment, trailers, ATV and UTV, motorcycles, frames, suspension components, and more. Temperature heat resistance up to 250 degrees Fahrenheit intermittently. Available in gloss and satin finishes. Mask off surrounding areas to protect from overspray. All right, so we're under here working on the engine bay, applying the VHT roll bar and chassis paint. Everything is clean. It's all masked off. We're going to satin black. This comes in both gloss and satin. We feel that the satin is really going to look nice on this chassis here and set off the engine bay. So. Everything's looking really good. Apply about three or four coats and see what it looks like when we're done. Apply paint in a well-ventilated area. Shake until ball inside begins to rattle, then shake for an additional two minutes. Shake can for 10 seconds after each minute of use. To spray, hold can parallel at eight to 10 inches from the surface to be painted and use in an even sweeping motion. Apply two light coats followed by one medium wet coat. Apply all coats within one hour, allowing 10 minutes between each coat. For additional coats after two hours, wait two days for paint to cure. Dries to the touch in 20 minutes. Handle in three hours. All right, everything looks great here under the hood. We applied the VHT roll bar and chassis paint in the satin black. We did the firewall, the frame, and the suspension, and things are looking excellent. Now, this is a perfect application for all of these areas, just for the fact that engine bays get hot. It's good to 250 degrees Fahrenheit. Also, this car is going to be subjected to all sorts of road abrasion and potentially some rain and maybe some salt. I'm not sure about that, but we're good to go there because it's good for corrosion and rust resistance as well. Now, even though we use this on a car suspension and frame, this is also perfect to use on UTVs, ATVs, and recreational type vehicles for their chassis, roll bars, frames, and all that good stuff to keep those protected as well. Now, for more information on VHT's roll bar and chassis paint and other VHT products, visit vhtpaint.com.